Texoma is right in the middle of one of the biggest migrations in the world, and local wildlife enthusiasts are trying to help preserve that. Aaron Gonders has more on how the Texas master naturalists in Wichita Falls, while they're trying to preserve the monarch butterfly migration. Yeah, Daryl, every year the monarch butterfly takes part in a migration that takes them thousands of miles from the northern U.S. and Canada down into Mexico, and then they go back again. Like many large undertakings in nature nowadays, the monarch migration faces several challenges, but the Texas master naturalists are hoping a little sticker can help scientists keep the migration alive. Tracking a cross-continental journey through the middle of the United States isn't easy, but it might be the key to the future of the monarch butterfly species. Every year, butterflies leave their breeding grounds in the northern U.S. and Canada and fly to particular groves in Mexico for the winter. Due to the challenges the butterflies face, the migration is under threat. Deborah Halter and the Texas Master Naturalists are trying to save the butterflies by tagging them and keeping track of where they came from before reaching Mexico. They bring them in and then they read the tags on it and, and they can tell us where they were tagged, where how far they came, because if some of them have been say, tagged up in Michigan and then recovered there, you know, some of them go over 3,000 miles. The Texas master naturalists are hoping by tracking the monarch migration and helping with conservation efforts related to that species, they can also save other butterfly species from the same fate. If we love and care for the monarch butterfly, we're also caring for a lot of other species that sometimes get overlooked. What we do to help the monarch butterfly also helps the other species in the same environment. Once the monarchs reach Mexico, their several thousand mile journey is over before they inevitably travel back to the United States to start the whole cycle over again. It's just amazing that this little bitty butterfly, maybe three inches long you know, wingspan, it makes it all the way from north, southern Canada, travels sometimes 3,000 miles to get to one particular set of groves in Mexico. They always go to the same place. They've never been there before, but they know how to get there. With every year, new monarchs fly south and back north again, and the Texas master naturalists want to be on the front lines, keeping the species safe. And if you want some additional information, just want to know more on the massive undertaking of the monarch migration, you can just click inside the story over on TexomasHomepage.com. Definitely a fascinating story. You really don't know what goes into that undertaking, thinking you didn't even know it needed that. So it's always great to learn something new. So, Aaron, thank you so much for bringing us that story.